ولكن يقولون ان استراليا 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 يقولون وحي كو تالا مغالا دا بيرت او يدو ساران بدوين تا هنديا غيلان هاد دبو حالكان كو داقي او سان دفرا بدن نحالكان كو هيي نين لو يقانا كريس او يساقو حرادان اسكالا ايه غيلا با نيكاسا ينوغا شاكين دونا لكن غيلا او حالكان كو هيو ان عانيه سال لإيبيا ان وحياوا كريم مدو اي كم بديهين شركا اي دادكو مرسدان بالغا سمايا وحاكا لو صد الحيس تاقاسا لايش اي دا ما داما ان جيل هل كان حري لغو هينين او ان انت بدن لدقنين اما با ان داو شوك هل اوي ما دحرادن كريس با دوين اوغشا كينيا ان بلا دحرادن يا جيل او كايو كريس how are you good thank you young man very nice to see you كريس tell me about the khan kalamunda so kalamunda mm -hmm. is an aboriginal name means smoke or fire kala and Munda is hills or forest. Wahuidi Maga Kalamunda, Wahuay and Lokada, I call Landatka, Asalahan Logu, you meet with the Australia, Aborigines Kaloya Kano, and Maka Kala, Wahuay Dabka Wudi, Munda and Awabora, Hamakawa Bori, Dabka. Why is it called Kalamunda? Why did you choose that name? Well, we choose the name Kalamunda because of the. the history of our area mm -hmm. and the Kalamunda spelling also has a C mm -hmm. for camels. Fantastic, fantastic. And um, tell me about the cam. When did you set up? Um, we set up nearly 30 years ago with the camels. I bought one camel as a pet. <laughs> <laughs> so you started with one camel? Started with one. And Uhuri, Sotos Rodm de Hatelicho, I am Herodan Semei, Harakubila, we would never kill you or Gela. And how many have you got now? We have 30 camels here on the farm, plus I have another 60 camels on another farm. Where to Hakaya Budu Sodon and Halat and where Kalan and Bukohaya? So originally, these camels, where do they came from, uh, Chris? Uh, the camels come from the wild. Uh -huh. um, Australia has one of the largest populations of wild dromedary camels in the world, about half a million of them. And we can go out and catch some. And in Australia, it is a million nephew girls and choga. And but in Kodi, we have a lot of girls. And I don't know how many of them choga. But if you come around the rock, it's a lot of girls. That will be good news for the Somali camel herders. It would be with plenty of good-looking camels too. We have to do a. Gelchiri Somali, the world works up on the line, the telescope, the hogel, the scassock of Sonia, the no Hurukur, the Kagatar and Wuliba. But this is typically the uh, same as the camels that we have in the Horn of Africa. Uh, uh -huh. You know, one ham. Yes. Yeah. So originally, where do they come from, these the, camels? Our camels come from uh, basically the Indian subcontinent, uh, Rajasthan, Pakistan, Afghanistan. So the English brought camels to Australia in the 1830s to 1860s and uh, we produced a much nicer camel by combining some of the different breeds. And what we did in English is that we were in Australia and we were in the United States 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 وحولي لكن وحن لقسمي يجيب الله يسكت على جيلي لأن جيلا قروح بدنا ونكسبها كصباحي. so do you have names for them? all of the camels have names yes. وحن ويدينو جيلا مقع يولي what is this one called? this one is Buddha. Buddha. a little fat Buddha when she was born. 
What about this one? This one is Horatio. Horatio. And this one, Wasim. Wasim. So if you call, if you say Wasim, will it Wasim. come? Wasim, come here. Wasim. What about this one? Buddha. Buddha, come on. Come here, Buddha. Come here. Like a typical woman. <laughs> Has a mind of her own. And so who, who comes here? What services do you offer? We offer Electricities. all services related to camels. So uh, basically tourism. Uh -huh. And we also have a camel dairy. Right. So we milk the camels and we take people for camel rides um, and we provide services to the industry who need camels. So. And what we do, that's what we do, we have to do a lot of work. We have to do a lot of work. Gila lagi lagi so hal kalau gue ibu, iyo wajib hal kalau eh 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 lama nafas at sedo eh gila lagi hello. So tell me Chris, how many camps like this are in Australia? Domesticated camels. I would suggest that there's probably about fifteen domesticated camels. Yeah. There are only about six camels doing dairy work at present, and the others are tourist related. أن حولي لا شنية تمن حرا أيا شراء ودك أستراليا وجيل الجو هيو قرب شراء أن عنا هيو هاي بيا but according to research camel milk has many many health benefits so why do you think there's no more camps the the camel dairy industry there are very few good quality camels in captivity domesticated um, and the industry is very young. Um, also, the market for camel milk is very low. It's, um, it's growing for its health benefit mm -hmm. and also from our, um, the people who are coming now to live in Australia who are familiar with camel milk. And really, and that kind of stamina, I'm not going to be able to do it, but I'm not going to be لكن ما كده كان صعب ضنا يا بودي، إن أنا هجيله يقانا، لكن لسكم هاي بودين ده، إن فايدو يدين عفنات كايلين. So which one is your favorite, Chris? I have so many favorites. Do you have a favorite? I do have a favorite. He is actually working with camel rides already this morning. Okay. So that's Henry. Henry. Henry is a very tall gelding. Uh -huh. um, but he has such a beautiful, pleasant nature. <laughs> but we have the milking camels also have, have favourites as well. Okay. Do you drink uh, camel milk? I drink about two litres per day. What is this one called? This one is Buddha. Oh, Buddha again. Buddha again. She likes the, um, I think she likes... She likes me. She likes you. Yes. You're handsome. Hello, Buddha. <laughs> Um, what about these ones? Uh, this is Zara. Zara. I think. Let me have a check of her name. A girl. Uh, this is my camel. Okay. And Wazim again, of course. That looks nice. Wazim looks very friendly. He is a very friendly, but very, very intelligent. Okay. Their intelligence level is, is different? With the camels, yes. yes. Um, some okay. more intelligent than others. And what we do, and we see more color. Well, get a wag like a button booty. They're not how we do you make color and family building in. They know who you are. Why color family building you will see more color. What are some good family market to my door? So, how many liters of milk? Uh, different camels, okay. different camels give different liters. Uh -huh. The best camel that I had, uh -huh. uh, she gave 14 liters. 14 liters in one work. day. One day. She did seven and a half in the morning and six and a half in the afternoon. Uh huh. Hush over Anna, but then Lafrey to one litter by Malinkil Lagamali to double literary about Sobahia, yet to double literary about Makrib here. So, where do you market the milk? We market the milk to the health industry and we sell it all across Australia. Okay. We send, we can have the milk on the plane and in your city overnight. Right. And 
أنا وحلو كي بنابو الأستراليا أردن أو سوقية ذا اللي جه له إن هي بقى عفنا تكلوا هذيك سدوا هي لقوا هي how much do you sell it for Chris we sell it twenty five dollars a liter شن إيه لو بعثن دولار باللتر كيلو سيا أنا جيلا أستراليا إن مركا دولار كم رايح كم مركا لا يقول إلا لو بعثن دولار بين غنيسا وحن حسوس تهر جيسا إن لتر كا هل نجلس نشري صدح دولار؟ تدبع ولا بقى دويو كل دوين ولا سوبر برلي كرا لكن صدح لتر بال نجلس نشري. What about this one? These are our milking camels. I we're going to milk those this morning. And ولا بكرة جيل يبقى المال يا and وحين يجي إن فرصة ما دي جيل إنه ما لي شري يبقى هذا هالكم. سيد الله ما له. يدو ولا بقى نجلس وجي and إنت هنو هذا كيمان إنه إن جيل الله ما له. These camels last year. Were in the desert. Wild camels. Some of the other children put in local bad years. Had they went to Australia, so they were caught only last year. Caught last year in November. Maka and halal swak of Taiwan and between November and some of the other. So how long does it take to make them domestic animals? With good training, a couple of months. What do you mean with good training? Well, sometimes bad trainers get bad results. Good trainers get good results. Skillful trainers. And we the intake at that time, Gail America and Sahara al Gasok of Thai and Eden al Hain Lagadigo, Gail Dakasha, did not hurry Tabar Kalasia Koranta, did Tabar and Axel Lasio and Nitichu and Axel Ligelia. So. So with we are going to milk them. We are going to milk them, but when you're talking about training, mm -hmm. if they don't trust you, yeah. when it comes to milking, no milk. So how do you milk them? Well, we start with by hand, mm -hmm. and then when they when they trust us to allow us to to get the milk out of them, mm -hmm. then we'll put the machines on. Yeah, <laughs> لكن إن إما كنا يجينا وحول مركب روح اللجوج جدلنا يا إن قعنتها مركب قعنت اللجوج جدليو إذا إحنا مشين كلو ريتشنيا. How you catch? How you catch? How you can see the size? إن كريس ما هو يدي استمادة ما إن مالي تشري مركب يرعى والحدينا ما أنت رايس كده يا. بني نبه ريرك يجيلي شرو مالي تشري لكن بحد جيليو مشين نبع إن شاء الله استعمال. And how should I make some money? I will do. And what I know about him, and what the affirmation that we know. So, because we milk a raw product, and we don't pasteurise our product, it's important that the health department who regulate our industry are confident that we have proper health safety in place for the public. Madam, we are going to have to see. لغو مالايون آن کوی بینو، و آنام وحبا کلا سار سارین، وح کلا لغو دارین، ان وحیا به نوگ بهیم بود وحدا دیگه گددوینه، و دوش کلا صعدا، ان سیدا آنو، ان آن هانو که این نه یه سیدا گیر الله مالو، و این شروع ده ها دارن بوحینه. Right, so we need hygiene for our hands. Gloves. So gloves. We also have some warm water. Warm soapy water. Uh huh. Or sabun nalla. To wash all the dirt off the udder. Marka an andala gele ayi wuhuri an biha dirhan a sabun thala mar khoral gu mai daya. Alright, so we wash that off. And then we don't do that in the Horn of Africa. We just go and milk them. Absolutely. And what we find when with cleanliness, it keeps the bacteria out of the milk. Wha we di Chris in. Look against Africa. Hola halu da gwa and the merkala swa hariyo and in leska malo. They know who di and merkasero kala lo maira anda da. Wa hikay raini sa bacteria di ana hasor ra ilay. So we also use when before we put the cups on, we also use an antibacterial wipe to make sure this antibacterial wipe. This one here. Tishvidas and or antibacteria da. Yes. Bacteria that will go out of the gallop. So you would wipe first and we put our gloves on and then we would... Yep, yep, yep. Okay. Madame and Diggy, look, come on, you want. Okay. So having done that, we will now bring the camels in. I will give you... I'm going to give you a little bit of a salt. I'm going to give you a little bit of a salt. I'm going to give you a little bit of a salt. 
حشو قول رسالة كنا لكينيا تعد نصدع هذا هذا كنا هالكني بحنيا بره دوحة صبيين ويجينا. This one? Yes. This identifies the camel. Uh -huh. And when we milk our camels, we record the day the camel was milk, which uh -huh. camel, uh -huh. um, how much milk it gave. Um, so we keep a record. We test the milk. We know how much it got to eat. We know how much milk it gave. And Chris, you heard it. I love the health of Surani. Wahalu garan ya gorti gila lamaalai, enti arah lama malai, and gila enti di lesiye, and arah and hita lama malai, sida ayihi tayahan, and yeah. Okay, so now we will go. We'll go. We'll go around this way because you're much skinnier than me. Okay. Right. And Madam Gila, the one who looks so comfy and look so hard, huh? در نکته سوپیش اگه این مرکز خود ای قهرتیان ولی آن لقب خان این لمارو در نه و خا حرکت کوچولویه. To um to milk, whereas the more domestic camels they get used to it. So just for safety, we will make sure her leg doesn't move around too much. The camels that I've had for. 10 to 15, 20 years, uh -huh. they will just stand like well, the Somali uh, camels. Well, again, I'm Tawanka Samadi, Lataka Samadi, Hakan Kohi. You either look up to them, Buddha, see Adia Lomala. Okay. Depending on where your vision is. Yeah. So this. We're going to go to the Lamaria, and Hashi, you ما حسلن عند ذي الله ما يري بيدي خلاص صابون الله الناس اللي كرسونا شاقي وحيد عسي شو تجي سا إن بكتيريا عنا يصير رحام ما دام الجيل إحنا الملف ربضنا في السماية حيا بكل الغيا بين التعبتان مخبرك يوم ما يري إما كنا واقع كرس تشوفي أما وقد يريد أنتي بكتيريا لحيد البكتيريا اللي يقولوا تقالوا بيجي أيوه ده نوع رأيي so it's ready for milking now ready for milking so this one we did مكان مركا دي أروت هاي إلا ماله I'll also check now to see and clear the um the milk so okay so to make sure she has some milk and it's all clear okay Alright, so you can see here, just just like you were doing the old days. So I'm going to start the machine. Okay. Can we do it by hand? Oh, we can do it by hand. Can I try it? You can try it. Well, I've done it. It's good to you, man. We'll be fine. Come on. Oh, oh. Been a while. Yeah, yeah. Been a while since you milked the camel. <laughs> so, for been a while, yeah. Been a while. What about the machine? We'll put the machine on now. And then the milk will, uh, will come out. The it will fill it. Yep. Uh, and the, the milk will go straight to. Into the bucket. Okay. Into the milking bucket, and then with. I am. Um, She goes. Well, I'm 
What I can add to the top, the best part. Uh, well, I'm here on my own. And welcome to the back of the world. I'm going to go to the back of the world. And I'm going to go to the back of the world. And I'm going to Fantastic. Thank you. Yeah. I was saying we don't use cups over there, you know. That's the only difference. <laughs> <laughs> when you spoke earlier about the cost of the milk, mm -hmm. it's the hygiene and the labour costs of milking the camels that's so expensive. Uh -huh. um, Australia So if, if more and more people um, in Australia mm -hmm. uh, bring camel milk, do you think the price will go down? Oh, definitely. Absolutely. Or Australia and a girl I bought her. If they move, also the IO did not read it. So, you know, you know, you ولكن <تصفيق> ولكنني <تصفيق> Chris, how we did you know? What she could in Hawaii, I take a magalay and get a lot of stuff and get a so many da. Then don't push again. I know what happened. Come magalay, but I can't tell you what magalay is. Hey, and get a so I will get a lot of area and yo and I know for a problem. I said I saw local so. Did you say the milking? Milking, good quality milking. And you push again. I know. Uh, like a model or add the other accent. And you know, 
و گیس کات کات این تا سوم کم غلای کریس و حلوشی کی انگیلا و حوال با لغاقی از قاطع لغو قیمیو هدی نقطه گورکا هدی نقطه مکتا هدی نقطه افکاب قل حلال ده این سومالی دایی قانونی نتایجی Would you consider yourself as a very, very rich man? I th- consider myself as a farmer uh-huh. who spends all his time and money on his camels. <laughs> <laughs> Not so much rich. Chris, I would say, Madam, the guy who is from Malaysia, 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 the guy who is <laughs> Always wanting something. We do a hassle scocally in Budo Gale and you and Borwalpa, Ego Bambudi, Lagu. We do a chill, Marcai, the mirror, in Maho, the Pida, the Saga, the Kaba, the I had one there is an increase or large increase of camel population then the government starts to kill them or kill them yes tell me about it we found that oh, sorry Hakris we did in and Gela would then can Australia why I want to come up late or I come to in market three so I add up a lot of in the blood to work and that's I could be so silly all I you I'm a mark of a girl in course or the weather log up all in that go here we found that some of the stations that have cattle on their properties were having trouble with camels the camels were multiplying too quickly and they saw them as a pest the ask the government to d- fix the problem <laughs> so instead of seeing the camel as a resource uh-huh. for meat or for export or for um, dairy they decided it would be cheaper just to shoot them waxa sheeg christmarka degmooyinka ay aad ugu soo dhawaadaan sidii aan sheegay in dadku marka ay arkaan geel inuu dhibaato ku noqonayo oo waxyeelo geysan karo dadna dawladda ay ka codsadaan in talaabo ay ka qaado dawladduna aan marka halkii ama laga iib geyn lahaa buulay dibadda looga dhoofin lahaa ama hilibkiisa yaanihii sala manafaacsan la in marka geela la laayo so in terms of numbers how much uh, how many camels are killed every year any idea they had five years culling and on those five years maybe 150,000 camels were shot to waste war maxaa meesha geel ku dayacmay tasan idin ku sheegi laba baa yaraad ba wuxuu yiri shan sanadood muddo ah aan boqol iyo konton kun oo halaad oo geel ah ayaa wuxuu dilaalayay aan markii sidaa soo kale ay loo arkay inay dadka halis ku yihiin 150,000 that will make lots of somalis rich absolutely and well that to no benefit and waxa kris ku yiri rag fara badan oo somaliya ayaa geela laalay oo ka dhigila tijaar dadna wuxuu yiri ha si aan faa'iido lahayn ayaa geela loolay and here we these ones from the wild like the, ones. Like the lucky ones <laughs> very much so ko no ko no safe kala have we day laga soo qabtay baadiya geela ko tararay geela bani tutaayi
Well, thank you very much. Thank you very much. My pleasure to have you, you both. Nabat Gilio. No. That's in Somali. Nabat Gilio. Nabat Gilio? Nabat Gilio. Bye-bye. Nabat Gilio. Marki Hausha, I'm not going to be able to kill you. Are you Chris? I'm not going to be able to kill you. I'm not going to be able to kill you. I'm not going to be able to kill you. I'm not going to be able to kill you. I'm not going to be able to kill you. I'm not going to be able to kill you. Yeah, I love you.